Have you ever wondered why Japanese people are generally healthier and have a lower obesity rate? It's not a coincidence. Japan's stellar health statistics are the result of a lifestyle that many of us could learn from. An integral part of this lifestyle is the traditional cuisine known as washoku, which emphasizes nutrient-rich, low-calorie ingredients like fish, seafood, vegetables, tofu, and seaweed. Rice, a staple in the Japanese diet, provides energy without the burden of excessive fats. But it's not just about what they eat, it's also about how they eat. Portion control, mindful eating, and an emphasis on enjoying each bite are ingrained in the Japanese way of life. Regular physical activity is also a key factor, with walking, cycling and traditional activities like martial arts and dance being commonplace. Add to this the Japanese government's health-conscious policies and you begin to see why Japan is a health superstar. So, what makes the Japanese lifestyle so conducive to health? Let's delve in. At the heart of Japanese health lies their traditional cuisine, known as washoku. This culinary tradition is a testament to the Japanese philosophy of balance and harmony, not only in flavors but also in nutrition. Washoku is characterized by its emphasis on fresh, seasonal ingredients. It's not uncommon to find a typical Japanese meal filled with various types of fish and seafood. These foods are not only delicious, but also low in calories and high in omega-3 fatty acids, which are essential for heart health. In addition to seafood, washoku features an abundance of vegetables. These are often served raw, pickled or lightly steamed to preserve their nutrients. Vegetables are a great source of dietary fibre, which aids digestion and helps to control weight. Next up we have tofu and seaweed, two more staples of the Japanese diet. Tofu, made from soybeans, is a fantastic source of plant-based protein. It's versatile, easily absorbing the flavours of the ingredients it's cooked with. On the other hand, seaweed is a powerhouse of minerals like iodine, important for thyroid health, and calcium, vital for bone health. Last but not least, we have rice. This humble grain is a staple in washoku, served at almost every meal. It provides a steady stream of energy without loading the body with excessive fats. But washoku is not just about what's on the plate. It's about how these ingredients are prepared and presented. The Japanese cooking techniques often involve grilling, steaming or simmering methods that retain the food's nutritional value while limiting the use of excessive oils. Additionally, the aesthetic presentation of washoku encourages a slower, more mindful approach to eating. Each dish is carefully arranged to appeal to the eyes as much as the taste buds, encouraging diners to savour each bite, appreciating not just the taste but the effort and artistry that goes into every meal. As you can see, the Japanese diet is packed with nutrient-rich foods that fuel their bodies efficiently. Washoku goes beyond being just a diet. It's a lifestyle, a philosophy and a testament to the Japanese commitment to health and longevity. Japanese meals are not just healthy, but they are also well portioned. Stepping into a traditional Japanese restaurant, you'll notice something strikingly different. The serving sizes. Compared to the larger portions we often see in Western countries, Japanese meals consist of smaller, well-balanced servings. It's not about depriving yourself of food, but rather it's about savouring a variety of flavours in moderation. This practice of portion control is rooted in the philosophy of harahachibu, which encourages people to eat until they are 80% full. It's a mindful approach to eating that helps prevent overindulgence and keeps calorie intake in check. But don't be fooled into thinking smaller portions mean less satisfaction. Quite the contrary, each bite is designed to be a burst of flavor, texture and nutrition, making the meal a fulfilling experience. Portion control is a simple yet effective strategy to keep calorie intake in check. It's not just a diet, it's a lifestyle. Physical activity and mindful eating are integral parts of the Japanese lifestyle. Let's dive into their world for a moment, shall we? Imagine walking or cycling as your primary mode of transportation. It's not just about getting from point A to point B. It's a conscious choice to stay active, to be in tune with your body and the world around you. This is the norm in Japan, where these simple activities are woven into the very fabric of daily life. But it doesn't stop there. Martial arts, a discipline that combines physical prowess with mental strength, are widely practiced. 
The fluid movements of traditional dance are not just a spectacle for the eyes, but a testament to the balance between body and mind. Even gardening, often perceived as a leisurely pastime, is seen as a form of exercise, engaging muscles and providing a sense of calm and fulfillment. Now let's shift gears to another cornerstone of the Japanese lifestyle, mindful eating. Picture yourself sitting at a table, laden with a variety of fresh, colourful dishes. You're not just devouring food. You're taking your time, savouring each bite, appreciating the flavours, textures and aromas. You're in that moment, fully present, not distracted by your phone or the television. This practice of mindful eating offers more than just a gastronomic experience. It creates a heightened awareness of hunger and fullness cues, no rushing, no overeating, just a harmonious relationship with food that nourishes both body and soul. And so it goes day after day. Regular physical activity, whether it's walking to work or practicing martial arts, keeps the body active and the mind sharp. Mindful eating, with its focus on savoring rather than devouring food, helps prevent overeating and promotes a balanced diet. By incorporating regular exercise and mindful eating, the Japanese maintain a balanced, healthy lifestyle. It's a holistic approach that goes beyond diet and exercise, one that we could all learn something from, and perhaps even incorporate into our own lives. Healthy habits in Japan are cultivated from a young age. The foundation for this is laid at school, where children are served lunches that are a model of balanced nutrition. Unlike the processed foods that are common in many school cafeterias around the world, Japanese school lunches are thoughtfully prepared with a variety of fresh ingredients. They typically include a protein source like fish or tofu, a bowl of rice for energy, and an assortment of colourful vegetables for essential vitamins and minerals. Seaweed, a staple in Japanese cuisine, often makes an appearance too, offering a unique blend of nutrients not commonly found in Western diets. These meals not only nourish the body, but also educate the young mind about the importance of a well-rounded diet. Children learn to appreciate the flavors of whole foods over processed ones and understand the role of each food group in their overall health. By starting young, Japanese children grow up with a deep understanding of nutritional balance. Societal norms and government policies in Japan also play a role in promoting health. In the land of the rising sun, there's a distinct emphasis on appearance and wellness, and these cultural norms reverberate through various aspects of daily life. Here, being overweight is often stigmatized, a societal pressure that can, in turn, motivate individuals to maintain a healthy weight through mindful eating and consistent exercise. Moving beyond societal norms, the Japanese government also takes a proactive role in fostering a health-conscious society. Through the implementation of public health policies, the government encourages healthy eating habits and active lifestyles. One may wonder, how does this manifest in reality? Well, it's quite fascinating. The government promotes the consumption of local seasonal produce. This not only supports local farmers, but also ensures that people are eating fresh and nutrient-rich food, a cornerstone of the traditional Japanese diet, washoku. In addition, nutrition education programs are a common fixture in schools and community centres. These initiatives are designed to instil knowledge about balanced diets and the importance of regular physical activity from an early age. They say knowledge is power, and in this case, it's the power to make informed choices that contribute to one's health and well-being. But it doesn't stop there. The government has also invested in creating infrastructure that supports walking and cycling. With well-maintained sidewalks, bike lanes and parks, it's not just convenient but enjoyable to incorporate physical activity into one's daily routine. Whether it's commuting to work or taking a leisurely evening stroll, these infrastructural elements encourage a naturally active lifestyle. So, you see, in Japan, health is not just a personal matter, but a societal and governmental concern. It's a collective effort, a harmonious integration of cultural norms, public policies and individual practices, all working together to foster a society where health and wellness are not just ideals, but a way of life. So, there we have it. The secret to Japanese health lies in a combination of factors. 
A key component is the traditional Japanese cuisine, washoku, which is high in nutrients and low in calories. Its emphasis on fresh ingredients like fish, vegetables, tofu and seaweed, along with the staple, rice, offers a wholesome diet. Portion control is another integral part of the Japanese lifestyle, ensuring that meals are satisfying without leading to overeating. Additionally, the cultural practice of mindful eating helps individuals savour every bite, enhancing the dining experience while maintaining a healthy balance. Regular physical activities, whether it's walking, cycling, martial arts or gardening, are woven into the daily routine, contributing to a fit and active lifestyle. Moreover, societal norms and government policies play a significant role in promoting health-conscious practices. From balanced school lunches to infrastructure that supports physical activity, these factors encourage a holistic approach to health. By understanding these aspects of the Japanese lifestyle, we too can incorporate these practices into our own lives for better health.